next to the wellhead of memory, the wellhead where the pale white cypress grows by secret twilight paths that no man knows, the shadowy path divided into three, Diana of the Ways and Hecate. O thou Hecate, mistress of the moon, I do invoke thee. Thou lady of midnight, Hecate, Hecate, Hect, thy very name is magic. We call unto thee, hear us, hear our devotion, by the bat whose wings draw forth the veil of night, by the toad whose venom brings the second sight, by the dog who hails the others with his bark, by the cat who prowls the mistress of the dark, by the owl who swoops in silent nocturne flight, and by the serpent whose shed skin is the symbol of new life, thee, thee I invoke. O oh, thou Hecate, whose face is hidden from the profane, I do invoke thee. Thou guardian of the three ways, Hecate, Hecate, Hecau, thine is the scourge and thine the kiss, thine the dark and spoken bliss, we call unto thee, hear us, hear our devotion, thou giver of death, thou the comforter, thou bringer of new life, thou who standest beyond the veil of silence, I invoke thee, thou who speaks the mother's word of power, I invoke thee. I stand at the crossroads, the meeting of the ways, where the past, the present and the future run as tributaries to the river's head at which I preside. The trivia, the meeting place whence run the rivers of life, rivers of semen, rivers of blood and of bone turned to dust that course down to meet the sea, the bitter black but fertile sea that ebbs and flows under the stars of eternity. My face is hidden and feared by men, but my name never lost throughout the aeons, for I am the mother of magic. I preside over the cauldron of creation and cut the thread that holds the spirit to the husk. I bear the knife that cuts the time, the skirt that wakes the life and the flame that lights the way. Fear me, for I am death, eternal, unchanging, yet always bringing change. And know that I have your name upon my lips. And here I wait, here on the shores of eternity, where I will wait for you, as I waited for your forefathers, as I will wait for my children, and as I will wait for their children after them. So know me, for when we meet I will embrace you tenderly and with love. 